Hello everybody, we are about to start our day and we always do that with a morning walk if weather permits. It's something that has helped our morning routine. When we get back, Liam knows that it is time for schoolwork. It just breaks up the day and gives really nice structure. So if that's something you're not doing, I would highly recommend it. Now today's video is all about Teacher Appreciation Day. If you don't know, a May 4th through the 8th year of 2020 is Teacher Appreciation Week. However, it's gonna look a little bit different this year due to the fact that we cannot give physical gifts. We can't see the teachers. And so I found a few different creative ways that I wanna share with you guys that you can use as well. So I have five different virtual ideas that I wanna share with you guys. First one is making a picture collage, whether it's pictures of your kids at school, other classmates, friends, whatever you can gather, maybe even reaching out to the class and gathering photos of the kids to make a picture collage and say thank you to the teacher. Gift idea number two is making a video that could be you recording your child, appreciating their teacher, what do they miss the most about the classroom, and just something cute and thoughtful. This is really about making thoughtful gifts for the teachers because that's really all that we can give. Now the third gift is semi-physical. This could be a gift card for one of the teacher's favorite places. It could be Starbucks, Dunkin' Donuts, Netflix, which I know we're all watching right now, but something thoughtful that really shows that you're thinking of them that they can still get joy out of. The fourth idea is just simply making a really cute yeah. note from the kids. Maybe it's a quote that you could put together, finding a creative outlet for them. Now these are things that I know bring joy to parents' faces all the times when our kids get creative, and I am sure the teachers miss getting some of these random drawings and thoughtful little cards. My fifth and last idea is simply to take a piece of paper, write down a few different questions, and have your kids answer them. What do you miss the most about class? What was your favorite memory from the year? To really, again, show that appreciation. I know this year is gonna feel a lot different, but I hope the teachers don't feel any differently and not appreciated because they are so valued and treasured and honestly, probably more this year than ever, which makes it really tricky, but still find a way to truly thank a teacher. Now, I hope this video gives you guys a little bit of inspiration for what you can do for your teachers and how you can show love. Also, if you are new to my channel, I upload videos every week and would love to have you join the family so please make sure you like this video subscribe to the channel and I will see you guys later bye mm -hmm.